Ashley Cole, among many others, was very complimentary about uh, Kieran Tierney's performance. I just wondered what you uh, what you made of his uh, performances since returning from from lockdown and how important he's become to that solidity of your defence. Yeah, I'm very impressed with him. Um, since I joined, just before he started to play games as well, just how he was um, acting and working on his rehab, you know. Everybody loves him at the club and it's not a coincidence. Um, he earns that in every single day. Um, the way he treats people, the way he works around the club, the energy that he brings uh, to the place. And then with his performance, I'm delighted. You know, he's adapted really, really well. He's a, a player that gives you everything in every session, in every game. And the quality as well that uh, he's adding. He's still so young, he's still things to improve obviously but uh, he's been a, a great addition to the team. I'm just doing my best every day, I work hard, um, the manager trusts me and I'll give 100%. Does he strike you as a, a, an obvious candidate one day to be a future Arsenal captain? Obviously something you know all about? I think he can be because he has uh, the respect and admiration of every member of the staff and every player. It's just the way he is, he does it in a natural way. Um, he's a really shy boy as well but uh, I think he represents like all this in the club, all the values that uh, we want to install and that they are in the DNA of this football club. How have you helped him and how big a transition is that for a player to make from Scotland to England? It is, but I think Kieran has adapted uh, really, really well. Obviously, it's a, a collective game and you need the right structure, the right people around you, the right players supporting you to play in, the, in his best position, obviously, and, and we are learning as well where he feels more comfortable and how he can be more, I can have a bigger impact on the team. And um, and it's a process that we are in, but uh, he knew the league really, really well, obviously, and he knows the difference straight away. Nobody has to explain that to him. He's just experiencing everything. And again, I am delighted with him. What was that feeling like when you knew you were definitely going to come to the Premier League, having achieved everything you did at Celtic? Yeah, it was, it was a great feeling for me, but it was the hardest decision of my life as well. I leave the club I've been at for 15 years, um, but as I said, delighted to be here. Um, Arsenal have shown great faith in me. got a record-breaking bid in, so delighted to be here. And, and he's got quality as well, most importantly, at both ends, as he proved tonight. Absolutely. I think uh, in both phases, I think he can do really well. He can still improve, but uh, at the moment, he's a real threat uh, in attack and he's been a really, really solid defensively. So it's the type of contribution we need for our fullbacks. Obviously, there's parallels are being drawn because he's because he's Scottish and people look at um, Andy Robertson and Robertson is clearly a very key player for Liverpool, creating chances as well as defending. Do you see Tierney as a similar sort of player? Is that what you want from him? Well, he's a, a key player for us. So I don't like to compare any situation there are two different players at two different clubs at the moment and a stage is in processes and um, Robert's on the play is now is not the play he was three four years ago so Kieran is on the right path. I guess with your Champions League experience that's what you're aiming here to get back into the Champions League that's what the manager said all along isn't it? Yeah I think the club uh, is a massive club that deserves to be in the Champions League and we know the ambitions and the aims of the club and the supporters and we're all in it together and hopefully uh, you just said that Kieran was um, quite shy. Can you explain to us, then, perhaps, what he's like around the dressing room if he is going to be a sort of a leader? He's shy. He's so humble as well, you know. And it's like he came here, you know, and it took him a while. He had a really bad injury and he's away from home. But uh, he's a natural leader. You see how he behaves on that pitch. Um, and when he talks, he says the right thing. And it's someone that, um, again, it's uh, exactly what we look for. And uh, I'm so pleased to have him in the team.